Hey, what is up you guys? Welcome to or welcome back to my channel. My name is Josh and I'm a makeup artist from New York and I have a brand new video for you guys today. Today we are going to be doing a full face of a brand new Marc Jacobs products. I picked up the most popular Marc Jacobs products from their website and we're going to be doing a get ready with me. So if you guys are interested to see if these products are worth your money, make sure to keep on watching. <laughs> Make sure to leave a comment down below what you think about this video and make sure to hit that thumbs up button for that youtube algorithm and don't forget to hit that subscribe button if you aren't subscribed to my channel already and make sure you hit that post notification icon so you're notified every single time i drop a brand new video but yeah let's get right into it as we usually do i'm just gonna go in with the bobby brown enriched vitamin face base and i'm just gonna use that as my all over primer for my face Now that I am all primed and everything, we are going to go in as usual with the Bobbi Brown Skin Foundation and I'm just going to go all over with that. And I'm just going to go in with my Beauty Blender. I think my foundation is exactly where I want it to be. So next I'm going to go in with the Jeffree Star Cosmetics Concealer. And I'm just going to conceal everywhere I usually do. Lay down my concealer. I'm just going to blend that in now. I finished the base for the face. Ooh, that rhymes. <laughs> I finished the base for the face. I finished the base for the face. Okay, so now we are going. Is she empty? Okay, now we're going to set my face, my face. So let's do that. Let's see how my thing is. Okay, it's looking nice. It's looking perfect. Okay, now that I'm back in the browser field, that's not true. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. I don't know what I'm doing. Next, there's no next. We haven't even gotten started. Now that we're getting into the video. So, now that we're here. <laughs> Today, we have these uh, brand new products from Marc Jacobs Beauty. We have four products that we are going to be going through, but we're going to be doing a full look as well. So first off, let's start off with the one I'm most excited for. From Marc Jacobs, we have the Marc Jacobs Omega Bronzer Coconut Perfect Tan in the shade Tantalize. And this is what the box looks like. This retails for $49 on MarcJacobsBeauty.com. The component does look like this. It's white and it says Marc Jacobs right here. And then when you open it, it has a little clasp right here. You just press it and then it opens like this. Okay, I can open it. <laughs> I do. I can't. Wait. Okay, I got it. I got it. I got it. I got it. Mm -hmm. And then you got the Marc Jacobs right there. And then this is what the shade looks like. And that's the tantalized shade. And it's honestly, I would have liked it a tad darker, but it's honestly perfect for my complexion. So I'm gonna go in with my Scott Barnes. Dem oh my God, it smells like coconut. <laughs> Is it the box or the component? I think it's the box. Yeah, the box smells like Kanzu products almost. The component a little bit, but not as much. Not, not like the Too Faced chocolate bronzer that smells like straight up chocolate and you can eat it <laughs> not this one. I like how big the mirror is, it's really big. So I'm gonna go in, but yeah, let's see how it looks.
Oh, I love the color. The color is literally perfect. Yeah, I love this bronzer. Okay. Um, wow. I really like how that's looking. I can't get over the fact that it smells like coconut. <laughs> yeah, I really like how it's looking on the skin right now. I mean, we could keep going with the next product. Let's continue for now. So far, I like how this is looking. Next, we are going to go in to the Marc Jacobs Velvet Noir Limited Edition Mascara. And this retails, I believe, for like $20 or something like that. I don't remember the exact price, but the box looks like this. And this is the Spring Runway Edition. I went with this one instead of the black one. And it looks like this, the component. It kind of looks like the Fenty Beauty component, but like a lot bigger. Like a lot bigger. Like this thing is huge. <laughs> like here's the teeny little Bobby Brown one. And here's this one, like comparison. <laughs> okay, so let's check out the doe foot. That's what we're all here for. We all know that's what matters. Well, I actually kind of like how the doe foot is looking. It has a little bit of a shape to it. It's not uniform. But yeah, let's see how it performs. That's all really that matters. So the Marc Jacobs Mascara, it's not too bad. The only problem I have with this guy is it's a little clumpy, which is not the worst when it comes to a mascara because what's nice is I have um extra spoolies laying around. So I just like to take these extra ones. And sometimes if it's too clumpy after, I like to just take the spoolie and kind of just get out those clumpy bits that I want to get rid of. And after I did that, honestly, the formula is really, really nice. If a lot of mascaras are very clumpy when they're brand new, so it could be that also, but... We're going to give it a few more tries, but not too bad. I think it was honestly a pretty nice mascara. Next, we are going to go in to the Marc Jacobs Magic Marker Waterproof Liquid Eyeliner. And this retails for $30, I believe it retails for. And this is in the shade Black, Black, Black Liquor, Blacker. <laughs> and it looks like this, the packaging. This is what the component looks like. It just looks like an old style pen, like a really nice one. Look at the tip. This is what the thing looks like. Very fine tip. So yeah, let's just do a quick basic wing. I freaking suck at freehand wings, so good luck to me. <laughs> I mean, I got one eye on. It's not the worst wing. It's not the best wing. Let's not talk about it. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna be completely honest. It's not that bad. <laughs> like, it could have been a lot worse. They're pretty even, too. Kind of digging it. Okay. Anyways. This eyeliner is honestly really good. It's one of the best eyeliners I've ever tried. Um, My biggest happiness... <laughs> The thing I'm really happy with about this eyeliner is eyeliner takes some time. Like nobody goes like, <laughs> like you have to draw, bring, fill. So a lot of liners, like literally you like draw two centimeters, dip, finish, dip, connect, dip, fill, fill, dip, fill, fill, dip. Like it's like four dips and you're just like, this one, I literally didn't even close it or shake it. And I did both my eyes. And I think it still had more ink to go. So it's really nice. It's it's really in the name. It's really a magic marker. <laughs> it gives you a lot of time to, you know, put this on. Which a lot of people are looking for. Because that's, that's what everybody needs. Some more time. We all looking for some more time. This bronzer is like amazing. Okay, anyways. Three out of four good products so far this is a scary one is mark jacobs just gonna hit it out of the park for us today next we have the mark jacobs omega glaze all over foil illuminizer and this is in the shade jet girl and this retails for i believe around like 20 something dollars 28 20 something i don't know something like that i got this all discounted because they had like a 40 percent off for now time so you guys want to go check that out i highly recommend it so this is what the highlighter looks like so it's similar to the bronzer <laughs> it's similar to the bronzer box just that it's like highlightery 
as you can see on the side. But yeah, let's pull this one out. Oh, whoa, look at the red one. This is beautiful. That is so mesmerizing. Wow, and I thought the white one was beautiful. She's basic compared to her. Wow, okay. Anyways, this is the Marc Jacobs highlighter in the shade Jet Girl. And this is what the shade looks like. I did swatch it already. I'm sorry. <laughs> I don't usually, but I did already. And it did have this little card as well, just like the other ones. These are really nice to protect it. But um, yeah, let's just go in. I'm going to go in with my Scott Barnes number 66 brush like I usually do. But yeah, let's go in and highlight. I feel like it has to be more blinding it's it's nice but like i just want a little bit more <laughs> like always you know oh wow i'm loving it especially for my skin tone this is a beautiful beautiful color now i'm just gonna go in with my finger and i'm gonna highlight my nose Who is she? I don't know her. The Tin Man. <laughs> Honest, wow. This highlighter is amazing for Marc Jacobs. I really, really like it. It's really, really beautiful. I do really prefer those like blinding highlighters from Jeffree Star, but this is just an immaculate highlighter. It's very, I believe it's very, very finely milled as it's a very, very creamy. Even in the pan, if you could tell, I kind of scraped it here and a lot of highlighters aren't, that creamy like so 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 creamy so it's very finely milled guys we've hit it out, out of the park with all these products what what's going on here <laughs> these products are stunning okay 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 we gotta finish off the look let's finish it let's finish it off let's see what we got left let's go in with some blush i'm gonna go in with my anastasia beverly hills trio compact and I'm gonna take my Scott Barnes number 64 brush. I'm gonna dip into the middle shade. Okay, I've gone in with the blush. And now I think we're going to finish it off with a nude. I'm gonna go in with Aquarius from the ColourPop Lippy Sticks. Okay, so I finished off the look with a lip from ColourPop. Now I'm just gonna finish off the eye with some Stila in the shade Rose Gold Retro. All right, that's it. I finished off the eyes with the Stila Rose Gold Metal and that's it for the whole Marc Jacobs look. Honestly, you guys heard my opinions doing it. <laughs> the highlighter was freaking amazing and beautiful. You guys can see it right here on my skin as well as the Marc Jacobs Coconut Tanning Bronzer. It smells like coconut, if that's one of your favorite scents. <laughs> and we also had the Marc Jacobs Velvet Noir Mascara. And last but not least, we had the Marc Jacobs Magic Marker Eyeliner. In my opinion, all of the products were freaking amazing, just like the Bobbi Brown products, if you checked out that video. And I would have no problem recommending you guys to go out and pick any of these up if you liked how they looked on me. But yeah that's pretty much it for this video i hope you guys enjoyed and make sure you guys check out any of my other videos that i have made in the past if you are here as well or make sure you guys click on my channel to check out a playlist to keep watching more of my videos all together non-stop i hope you guys enjoyed make sure you guys check out think of the podcast my podcast with my cousin we make a brand new episode every single week the link will be in the description down below so make sure you guys Go check that out and yeah, I'll catch you guys in the next one. Make sure you guys hit that like and subscribe button and leave a comment down below what you think I should do next. Uh, I don't know what else to say. Peace out. <laughs>